hello from us today we will be talking about how to be a successful woman in all aspects of your life this is what this channel is about it's about helping you become your best possible self when it comes to your finances your business your mindset your health and your appearance all of this comes together to play into the role of becoming a successful woman and my name is Karina welcome back to my channel if you like this type of content subscribe to the channel and also check out my million dollar lady wealth building program that you can find linked down below so what does it mean to be successful of course every woman has a different definition because we all have different goals that are always changing and hopefully growing but I will say that ultimate success really comes from within it is a feeling that translates into action, that translates into things appearing, into your goals coming true. And that comes from internally. That is your confidence. If you don't have confidence, your chances of being successful are already at least slimmed down into half. And let's talk about this confidence and how it translates to pretty much every aspect of your life. Because when you don't have confidence, you can be easily taken advantage by other people whether they're friends romantic partners you don't know your self-worth you're easily accepting of things that you shouldn't be accepting of such as relationships that are not ones you deserve friendships that are not there for the right reasons maybe people are trying to use you or trying to dump their emotional baggage onto you and you think that this is normal that this is okay that you should be accepting of these types of people well in reality this is really setting you back in life when you don't have confidence you also don't think you deserve some of the amazing things in life you don't deserve money you don't deserve a successful business maybe you don't deserve an amazing partner or luxurious travel vacations or to even look amazing maybe you feel like you don't deserve to look your best to feel and look beautiful not having confidence typically ends up you settle for breadcrumbs in your life and you accept it now let's look at the other side of things if you do have confidence if you know that you are looking for validation not from external sources but from your inner self that no matter what results you get in life it's not going to change the way you perceive yourself because you know that things don't just fall on people's laps easily right so no matter what outcome happens if somebody mistreated you if you got fired if somebody lied or cheated or stole or betrayed you or treated you poorly that has nothing to do with you you're being the best you possibly can it's their problem now if you take that and you say this is my fault the way other people are behaving is my fault and is directly at me then that's not confidence and you think that you are the issue and that ultimately sets you back in life so the first point is from your mental state you have to have enough confidence where you know that if you fail at something if someone is mean to you if someone breaks up with you that it's part of life and it has no reflection on you maybe you learn some things from there but you know what you just gotta keep moving on you can't look at every failure or every betrayal as this is my fault and that's how it's going to be right if you are so self-assured if you are certain in yourself in your goals you have a clear head you know what you want you know what you deserve then nothing can derail you no person no event and no circumstance no feeling feelings come and go but if you have this in your mind you know you can still accomplish literally absolutely anything that you want despite what happened so that of course is mental now let's talk about the financial confidence that breeds success i'm the person who thinks money does solve a lot of problems money does make life easier does money make you happy money doesn't give you a permanent emotion maybe if you buy something you feel instant gratification maybe if you do something good for somebody you feel good but again if you don't have that internal foundation money is not going to make you happy but 
when you master the internal confidence and you do start to get money, that money mostly comes if you're starting from nothing or if you're building something, it comes from your work. It comes from you. It comes from your success. It's not just money that fell on you because you won the lottery right? It's because you work hard. So that money is a reflection of your efforts. It's a reflection of you striving for your goals. And when it comes to you, you feel even more confidence and more security because you see your results are starting to pay off, maybe even after many different failures. And why money is good and why I talk a lot about investing on this channel, why I teach women how to invest their money, even if they don't have a business, even if they have just a small income, or if they want to start a business or they want to use that money to build something for themselves. This is why it's so important because it does give you more freedom. It gives you more flexibility, more ability. If you have money, you will not find yourself in a situation where you can't get out of it. You won't find yourself in a situation where you can't build your dreams, where you can't do your activities, where you can't do the things that you want to do because you don't have money. Say a person is in an abusive relationship or even in a marriage where they are being financially abused or the funds are being withheld, that they have to ask permission every time they need money. That where does the confidence go there? You it makes you feel like a child, does it not? If you are trying to ask somebody for those funds. But if you know that you have the ability to generate income, I'm not saying even millions of dollars, but enough to give you freedom, not even freedom, but options. Enough to give you options. That's all you need. Enough to say, you know what? I have to move to a different place. I have to pay rent somewhere else. I have to fix a problem on my car. I need to fix something within myself. Maybe I want to spoil myself and go on a nice vacation or get something nice for myself. You have those options. If you are a mother, like I am soon going to be, it also gives you many options. Maybe you have dreams outside of motherhood you want to pursue. Starting a business, starting a clothing line, starting a company and you need funds for that. Maybe to either fund the business or help you with tasks around the house like cleaning and cooking. That gives you options as well. So that is why it's so important to have financial literacy and financial confidence and not just overspend on things when there's less responsibilities, but really build up that money mindset, really build up that wealth. Start, no matter what age you are, just start thinking of the future. And that is financial confidence, okay? And then the last section of confidence is, of course, none other than your appearance. It does matter how you feel. Looking a certain way will make you feel a certain way. Now, of course, every day we can't get glam and do our hair and makeup. Sometimes we have to invest in ourselves, invest the time to look nice, maybe put on a little bit of something, take care of our skin, take care of our hair, really show ourselves that self-love because that builds confidence as well. We look a certain way that makes us more productive. Now, not every single time, like I said, because there are days where I'm just working from home in my sweatpants, right? And that's just something that needs to be done when there's a lot of things to do. If I just need to go on my computer, check my emails, check everything, I don't need to get dressed up for that, right? But if we just completely cross that out and don't put any effort into our appearance all the time, that does take a mental toll on us. We need to get confidence within ourselves that I do dress nice, especially when I want to. I can do my hair, I can do my makeup, I can look a certain way, and that will give you a confidence boost. You're not going to be comparing yourself to other people as much, saying they look better than me for this reason, for that reason. It's not something we should be doing at all all. We need to be growing within. We need to be self-loving and loving our appearance and building our confidence from within to love every aspect of us, whether that is even just in sweatpants or knowing that we can dress up and look absolutely amazing. But either way, if we have those three areas, it's going to be really hard to knock you down by anybody. So that's going to be it for this video. I hope that you enjoyed it. Let me know what you think in the comments. 
Subscribe to the channel and check out my wealth building program down below, milliondollarlady.com. My name is Karina. I'll see you in the next video.